This video is brought to you by Manscaped. Use the code TUBES20 to get 20% off all products and free shipping at manscaped.com. Yes, lads, it's Tubian Talks Footy here. And in today's video, we are back again with the live match reactions. It has been a bloody while. It's been about 10 days, but we are fully back and back in action. And so are my boys, the Gunners, the Arsenal are back again. And we face Liverpool tonight at the Emirates Stadium. We've, we've suffered a couple of injuries during the international break. David Luiz and Granit Xhaka are out for tonight as well as our star boy Bakayo Saka but we have a lovely lovely front four of Nicolas Pepe, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang returns to the side, Martin Odegaard after recently winning our player of the month is back and Lacazette as a striker absolutely beautiful you love to see it but Arteta why aren't you starting Martinelli um the last time we faced Liverpool at the Emirates we put them away by two goals to one. That was when they were comfortably champions. Tonight, it's a completely different story. They sit in seventh, I do believe, or sixth. I think it's sixth. We sit four points behind them in ninth. A win tonight would take us just one point behind. Jurgen Klopp's Reds, who named Diego Jota on the bench, with a, which is a bit bizarre for me. Firmino starts as the number nine tonight. But if we win, we go one point behind the Reds. If we lose, we are seven points behind and our top six hopes are absolutely done and dusted. But tonight is huge. This could be the turning point in our Premier League season with a win. A loss would just be a disaster. But come on, you Gunners, do not let me down. I am feeling quietly confident tonight. Arsenal 2, Liverpool 1. Goals by Nicolas Pepe, my ice cool man, and Alex Lacazette. Come on, you Gunners. Let's have it. Do not let me down. Right, we're underway at the Emirates after the knee for Black Lives Matters. We're here with two, unfortunately, Spurs fans. Ollie and Max up the Gunners going for a 2-1 win. We need to make a very fast start tonight um, against a Liverpool team that will be very hungry for a win. Away wins are more likely for them than a home win. So I wouldn't write them off, but I wouldn't write off this Arsenal team. We've shown we are capable of beating anyone on our day and we'll prove that tonight with a 2-1 win. Come on, you Gunners. Right, we're in the 19th minute. Rest in peace, Claude Caligari. He was a proud Arsenal fan and hopefully we can win this game tonight for him. Claude, we will remember you and the boys will do you proud tonight. We love you, Claude. May you rest in peace. The 20th minute, and Alex Lacazette has just suffered a horror injury um, on his like side of his eye. He's gonna he, well, he did get that stitched up, and now we can carry on. But I have to say, this is one of the most boring starts to a game I've seen in a long time. Get a grip, Arsenal! Bloody hell, we have offered absolutely nothing so far, and Diogo Jota. Um, is still on the bench for Liverpool, so more firepower for them. Great. I'm Liverpool, this is oh. easy for them. Salah, surely in, oh my, oh my goodness. God. How did that not fall to Bobby Firmino? Uh, brilliant defending by Gabriel Magalhaes, but Callum Chambers should, and Rob Holding have got absolutely spun. They should have never let Sadio Mane there in the first place. We're just done the half an hour in. And so far for Arsenal, this is looking like an absolute bloody shambles. I don't know why Mane on. Mane. Why did Mane pass that? He was in through on goal alone. Kind of bottled it, really. What a chance for Liverpool there. Trent Alexander Arnold put a ball in. Thomas Partey, what are you doing, son? Leaving James Milner completely unmarked. No one there surrounding him. He has all the time in the world. He couldn't, couldn't even hit the target. And he misses it there. Bloody hell. We have got out of jail at least twice so far. This is awful. Second half is underway. And now we just need to see... A better Arsenal performance than that first half. Absolute shambles. Liverpool, if they want to win this game, they need to be a lot more clinical. We just need to be a lot better than we were in that first half. And let me tell you, it's not that difficult because we were awful. Stunder an hour in. And Max, who was on for Liverpool? 
Diogo bloody Jota replacing Andy Robertson, who hasn't had the greatest of games. But Jota, I'm not surprised he's on. It's only about time. It's only about time that Jurgen Klopp brought him on because he will add a completely different bit of attacking flair to this Liverpool side. He's a lot more direct than Firmino, but he's replacing Robertson, which is a bit of a weird one for me. Would have expected for him to replace the Brazilian number nine, but Jota is on and he is sure to cause Arsenal problems. Goal! 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 Goal for Liverpool! It's Diogo Jota! He's so good! Uh, I don't know what to say. It was coming. Callum Chambers. No, sorry, Cedric Suarez. What the f are you doing? What are you doing? Abamyang is further. Oh my! What a ball in from Trent. Jota heads it. Leno can't do anything about it. It's 1-0 to Liverpool and I'm not fucking surprised. What a header. After three goals in the international break, he's back in the goals. Diogo Jota got his first goal for Liverpool back in September against Arsenal and he's done it again. Arsenal nil, Liverpool one. Am I surprised? Absolutely not. Salah was in. Salah scores. 2-0 to Liverpool. It came so out of nowhere. The camera was off. It's as easy as that. Gabriel gets absolutely roasted. He slides it under Leno. And it's Arsenal nil, Arsenal nil Liverpool 2. Easy as that. Mo Salah marks his 150th Premier League appearance. With a goal. Well done, Ar well done, Arsenal. Well done, Arsenal. Well done, Arsenal. Well done, Arteta. Well done, Arsenal. Trust the process. Well done, Arsenal. Crumbling once again. Pain. Arsenal nil. Liverpool three. We're crumbling. We are crumbling. We are crumbling. And we are crumbling. Salah through to Mane. Mane to Jota. Jota smashes it past Leno. And it's 3-0 to Liverpool. Isn't this just brilliant football from Arsenal? You know, got to trust Arteta's process. It's going really well, you know. We're only... We're only ninth, very much up to the standard. You love to see it. Well done, Arsenal. Fucking great. Right, I've left the room, but it is full time. Arsenal nil, Liverpool three. Um, spineless. Um, that's one of the many words I could use to describe that. Poor, uh, lethargic, boring, slow, terrible, crap, awful. Just absolutely nothing offered from Arsenal tonight. Um, that's probably our worst performance of the season overall. Um, I haven't seen us play that bad in bloody ages. Liverpool completely outclassed us. Man to man. Man to man. We were awful. Absolutely awful. Um, um, player ratings will be out on Twitter soon. Um, match reaction. Um, instant match reaction out very soon. But it just overall, just absolutely bloody awful. Everything about that Arsenal performance. Shut up, boys. They're, oh, they're pissing me off, honestly. 3-0 Liverpool, full-time. We head into Slavia Prague on Thursday, and this is the worst possible, possible result um, to go into that. But yeah, like, subscribe. Arsenal 0, Liverpool 3. Well done, Mikel Arteta. Absolutely superb. Top, top manager. My manager, actually. Trust the process. See you, lads. Bye-bye.